All right, everyone. So look what I have here behind me. This is a brand new construction, a brand new tour for site built Saturdays. This is a crazy big home. We've got so much to see. We're gonna check out the exterior and then we're gonna head on in and look at everything. Before we do that, let's roll that intro. sit back and relax this is going to be a lot of fun i'm going to be extremely brief out here on the exterior because we just have so much square footage that we've got to check out but i do want to show you a good look here at the front look at the beautiful brick and then we've got the stone work and then this front entrance right here is just next level i mean like when we walk in, when you go into those front doors and just the views you get is amazing as well. But just standing out here and looking from the exterior to me really catches my attention. I am in Tupelo, Mississippi, and this home has just been completed. Very, very thankful uh, Tyler has let me tour this amazing home. And I'm gonna have a lot of details and stuff in the description and we'll talk a lot more about the house at the end of the tour. So stay tuned for that. Before we walk into the front door, I wanted to come over here and give you a shot of this. We have three garage doors. We got two of them up right here and then I got one down. And then we've got several, several rooms upstairs. Like, I don't even want to get into that, but that is one of the rooms up top there. Uh, like, it's a big media room, a lot of cool stuff we're going to see. I do want to give you a shot from this side. Also, we got a killer back porch with a fireplace, but we'll check that out from the inside. But one thing that really catches my attention here, y'all be sure to drop me some comments along the way, tell me what you like and all that, but I love these fixtures outside. I can see these, I can just picture this at night. That would be beautiful right here on every uh, section. All right, let's head back around to the front head in. I'm just trying to visualize if this was my house, that would be like my neighbor right there. I'd be like, what's up, Prince? Is that the... Is that the prisons? <laughs> okay. Okay, no more dad jokes, okay? Cullen's told me I've had to cut I've got to cut that out. It's embarrassing. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Look at those beautiful windows. That's in a really sweet room right there right off the front. This is one of what what I wanted to make sure we definitely spend some time. Like these doors right here, look, like they don't look like they're eight foot, they're eight foot doors. Obviously, if I was standing up beside them, you'd be able to tell. But look how, just how high this is. We have vaulted ceilings right here in the living room. We've got those same fixtures here on each side of your door. It is showtime, ladies and gentlemen. We got a lot to see. Do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you enjoy this type of content. And drop us a like, if you will. Let's go. I want to give you the full effect as we walk in this front door. Breathtaking. Literally. Oh my goodness. So crazy. There's gonna be so much to take in. I'm just gonna to try to hit the things that I see, but if maybe y'all catch something that's really cool about this home that I don't mention, be sure to drop it in the comment section. So you walk into the living room here, the first thing that I notice is these have prop, these have got to be the biggest windows I've ever seen in a home. Like I said, you got the vaulted ceilings, you got that ceiling fan that drops down really nice. 
Uh, and then the kitchen and everything else, I believe, is 10 foot ceilings, except your foyer area. I know it's higher than 10. You got this place right here. It can be set up for gas or wood burning. And they went with the stone around it. And then you have a really nice layer of this brick right here on top. Massive baseboards. The crown molding is really big as well. I'll get a shot of it. Now, are y'all ready for the shot of this kitchen? Here we go. Hold your breath. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> this is wild. You got the tongue and groove on the ceiling right here. And yeah, this is gonna be 10 foot. Look at this kitchen island, you guys. I, I've never, like I'm I'm super excited. Like at the time we're recording this, I'm like, y'all are gonna trip when y'all see this home. I think, he told me, I'm not 100% sure, but I think this is a six by 12 piece of uh, quartz. This is like the biggest uh, you can get, like the biggest slab you can get of quartz. And I noticed that uh, this home has KitchenAid appliances. There's some really nice appliances. But yeah, you can see the crown molding there, just how nice it is all the way across the top. And this quartz like goes up your wall right here. These fixtures look really good in here as well. Yep, I knew that. I knew what that was. That's the double garbage. I mean, you know, this type of house, you got to go double on your garbage. I mean, you double everything, really. Yes, that is a pantry in the corner right there. And uh, I'm just over here. I'm actually stretching. <laughs> now, I wanted to circle back around and make sure I showed you this. Like you have these cabinets here on this backside, great for storage. Now come on. So it's a it's a pantry and a pantry. Oh my god. Okay, so I took a deep dive into this home before I started video because I was just like trying to get a game plan together. So I seen this, but yes, it is a pantry in a pantry. It's like a double pantry. What you do is you put all your healthy food right here so that it's closest to you, but then this is like the dark, the, the bad stuff. <laughs> and you know, it just, you, I don't know where I'm going with that. Okay, we got we got so much to see, we gotta go. This is your dining area over here. All these beautiful windows. Man, these are just like, this window, is this the same? I think this may be the same as those ones in the living room, but there's three of them. This why one right here, I'm not exactly sure. It's just a huge window. Eight foot wood door right here going out to your back porch. We're gonna take just a quick look because we got a lot more to see on the inside. I'm just like, Picture in a Sunday afternoon, maybe smoking some ribs, watching some football out here. This is super sweet. You got another fireplace out here as well. It's same way on it, gas or wood burning. Okay. Plenty of space out here. I know I got some drone shots of this as well. So let's head back in. That way goes into your two room upstairs and your main bedroom. But I want to go back this direction, look at these bedrooms, and then we're going to go back that way and check all that out. We come down here right off of the front doors. We have this room. This is where all those beautiful windows were that we looked at on the exterior. Remember? Remember I pointed those out to you? This is like a big... Mm, you could do a lot of stuff with this room. I would... I think a really cool office would be nice. Um, or it could just be a sitting room. I don't, I don't know. What would y'all like to put in here? 
But that is not an ordinary doorway right there for sure. I want to get a shot of the rim. It's rather unique. It just keeps catching my attention. So then we walk down through here. We got some bedrooms and some bathrooms over this way. Our first thing that we're gonna see is a bath right here. This is what they're doing nowadays. They don't put a mirror up because basically you don't have to, <laughs> I'm just kidding. The mirror's not just installed yet. I was, I was gonna try to come up with something funny, but I'm, I'm telling y'all, ever since Cullen told me that, like I'm, I'm afraid to make any jokes. Look at this tub. It's like squ it's square, like I hadn't seen anything exactly like that. Subway towel right here. Make sure I give you a shot of your towel. And here it's different than what we've seen throughout the rest of the home. Come out of here and we've got our first bedroom of the tour, ladies and gentlemen, actually. Is this a third pantry? First bedroom of the tour. What about that window? You want to talk about showing y'all some stuff that I ain't never even seen. I like. I, the problem is I don't know what half what what to call half of this stuff. But regardless, you'll be able to uh, check things out and just get some ideas made if you're looking to build or something like that. <laughs> so there was our first bedroom. We come out of there. And then we've got two other bedrooms down here that share a bath. Let's actually start with this one. Here's our second bath. This bath has double sinks. Once again, the mirror just hadn't been installed yet. But wow, look at these sinks. This is the same uh, course that we've seen there in the kitchen. And I absolutely love the trim around the doors. Same uh, towel that we have in the, in the bath that we have in that other one. This is a I, I can't 100% say, but I feel like this is a bigger shower tub combo right here. And plus, we have our own door. I know the last time I toured a home like this size, the video ended up being like 28 minutes or something. So I'm going to try to maybe cut down on that just a little bit. But I don't want to miss anything. We even have eight foot doors, like interior doors. All your interior doors are eight foot as well. I like the built-ins that, that we're seeing in all these closets. Now let's go down here and check out the utility room and then make our way upstairs. Cool. So right there goes into your main bedroom, and it's one of the craziest uh, bathrooms that I've definitely ever been able to tour. But yeah, before we go upstairs, let me show you our utility room right here. It, you have a door that walks in. Now that door actually goes into the main bedroom closet, but I actually shut that because I don't want to give that away just yet. So we got quartz in here. This looks like a little bit of a different quartz that we have in our utility room, but we got these same really nice cabinets. I love the pools. And this tile is different than what we've seen in those baths, but I think this is gonna be like your same tile that uh, is gonna be in the main bathroom. Spot for your washer and dryer right there. This is a really big room. We walk out of out of here, get our t-shirt for the day. And uh, yeah, we got these uh, nice lockers as soon as you walk in. 
Uh, that goes into the garage. I'll probably wrap things up out there. I'm sorry. I didn't even point that out. That's, that's where you're coming from, the garage. Now, let's go upstairs. Y'all, <laughs> this is crazy. I mean, I, I really can't remember how many rooms are up here right at the moment, but it's like a lot of square footage. So as you walk up the stairs, you have this section right here, and then we have rooms like in every angle. Let's start with this one. This is gonna be that room over your garage. When I showed y'all the exterior uh, dormer, this is it right here. It's just a huge room. And it's got two closets. And we've got a bath up here as well. A full bath with double sinks. Same countertop, same quartz countertops. And this, this is a big bathroom. Yeah, so see, this tub is the same one that was in that first bath we looked at. I feel like it's a little bit smaller than that, that the most recent bathroom that we just looked at. Hope I'm not confusing you there. You know, I didn't even open no kitchen cabinets, though. What a shame, Chance. You're letting the people down. Okay. So, we're back out into this section. We've got another room right here. This room has its own closet with double doors. And this room is actually positioned, if um, I know I got some drone shots of the back, there's a dormer on the back. This is it right here. But I like this area. You can look out into your backyard, nice sitting area. Really sweet. And if you thought that was the last room upstairs, well, you was wrong. <laughs> we got one more. Which way is it, y'all? It's this way. Look at this. So one thing Tyler was telling me is they went 10 foot ceilings in this room. So it could be set up, um, trying to remember what he called it, like a, like a theater room where your, you know, your seats like gradually go up. I mean, I've never seen upstairs with 10 foot ceilings. I mean, maybe you, you have, maybe that's, you know, an everyday thing to you, but not for me. I'm gonna show you something else cool in the attic. Um, but let me show you this little closet or I'm not exactly sure. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know what this room is. <laughs> Looks like it'd be a good storage room that goes into your attic. But this is what I wanted to show you in this attic over here. But look at that. I mean that, that had to cost some dinero right there just to do that. So you come out here, make sure, I, I tell you what, let me get my light on. So look at all of the attic storage. You have all this right here, but then they even made it where you have these stairs right here. Oh, come on mate, follow me. And then you got more storage uh, area up here. I'm showing you everything in this one. <laughs> all right. We got to go to there and check out the main bedroom, main bath, y'all. Come on, let's go. So, as we come into your main bedroom, it is something special. Look, I'm going to give y'all a shot into that with the doors open, but 
I do want to, I don't want to take away from at least spending just a second just to see the size of this room. But I mean, oh my, oh my gosh. Oh my. <laughs> I feel like I've said it before, but you know, as time goes on, I'm able to tour even more homes. This is probably the coolest bath I've ever put on the channel. Are y'all ready? Oh, <laughs> should we just go all in? Let's go all in. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. We're gonna take a deep dive into it. Oh, there's some, everything is just huge. Let's start out with this. Once again, you know, our mirrors aren't here, uh, but we got double sinks, one on each side, plus we have this area right here. But before we really look at the tub and the shower, I want us to just look how big of a room this is. I mean, look at all the space you have right there. And this with the same tile that we seen in that uh, up, uh, no, in the utility room, right? Yeah. Or laundry room. Okay, so here's our other sink. What I like about this is both sinks have a ton of uh, like countertop space. You know what, since we're pointed this way, let's go ahead and look at this closet. Is this the kitchen? Is that a kitchen aisle? See, I mean, this is like, this is what you consider uh, a kitchen aisle. I mean, I've seen some bigger than this, but that kitchen island in there is crazy. This is what I would consider a mansion, you know. I see a lot of mansion tours on YouTube and, you know, they're like crazy, you know, 20,000 square foot or something like that. I don't know, something ridiculous. But to me, if you was able to live in something like this, I don't really know what else you need. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I feel like anything bigger than something like this is just kind of maybe you just got money to blow. But see, there's that door that goes into that uh, laundry room I, that I had shut. I'll open that back up. Wow, wow, wow. Huge closet. Okay, now this shower and this tub is breathtaking. I know we got a little bit of a look of it, but let's go even more in depth. And I know we had not looked at the water closet. We'll come back around to that. I love this tub. I love, I like to see your faucets in the tub like that. Personally, that's what I like. And so the shower is like, it doesn't have doors, but you have two ways to come inside. Let me see. Yeah, get us a light going in there. It's got the body sprayers lined up down through here. You got the wand, shower head. You've got uh, one way up here up top. I want to give you a quick shot of our floor there. That's great. What a room. Yeah. So I got to at least give you a shot of the water closet. I mean, we can't go through a tour without at least showing that to you. Y'all definitely be sure to drop me a comment on this video. Let me know what you think about this home. Just maybe some stuff that I didn't even mention that you saw that was really, really cool. Don't forget to like this video if you have not. That helps us out tremendously if you would take the time to do that. Also, let me say if you have not subscribed, hit the notification bell. Subscribe. I want to do more of this. Let me know if y'all want to see more of these types of homes or what y'all want to see. And there's got to be at least one person that, that you could share this video with and just be like, look at this mansion. This is crazy. Thank you. I know this has been a long tour, but I do have to let y'all know, I know I've been talking about the home that was coming that had just been framed. Don't worry, it's still coming. 
I went ahead and put this one out for this site built Saturday just because of several different things. One of the main reasons is I can go ahead and give all of this to Tucker Construction and they can share and promote this brand new home that they just built. So it just seemed to be better fitting, but don't worry. That other one's coming, stay tuned. Now a couple more things and I'm gonna be out of your hair. I do wanna say this house right here is super large. Be sure to check out in the description for size, square footage, bedrooms, baths, and all that. When it comes to pricing on something like this, I really don't even know exactly. Uh, I think it was listed somewhere around the 900,000 range. I don't, you know, my, my whole deal with these types of homes are just for entertainment and then for y'all to just be able to see and kind of give you ideas on stuff and you know, figure out what you like and what you don't like. It's kinda, it's kinda why I do these tours. I'm gonna cut on out of here. I hope every one of you have a blessed weekend. Y'all come back Tuesday night, 6.45 will be the next video. Until Tuesday night, God bless, and I will see y'all then. See ya.